a signal around the globe. Direct from New York City. New York City. It's Brad Blanks. We were sitting in the corner and I came in. You're eating your lunch. Anyway. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. These are the stories I'll write in my memoirs one day. <laughs> no one will buy. Um, New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, Amanda Iannucci, how are you, buddy? Good to see you. I'm Brad. Yeah, you're going well. I'm Amanda. Yeah, yeah. How are you, sir? I'm good, thank you. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, it's um, uh, a, a great thing you've pulled off here to get um, your talents to be shown in America, isn't it? You know, in terms of your writing ability on an American telecast, uh, well, uh, back by HBO. Very, thank you very much. I mean, HBO are, are great in that they approach you and they say, we like what you do. Yeah. Can you do some of it for yeah. us? And, and we're not going to tell you how to do it differently because we like what you do. Yeah. And that's the difference, you know, yeah. because you hear so many stories of people who come over to From Hollywood yeah, right, yeah. and then it's all different, it's all different you know yeah. but uh, you were able to just to do your own thing and yeah. you, you brought a bit of your team with you as absolutely well? yeah, yeah. Uh, and uh, you know I'm based in the UK and yeah. we kept that side of things going in fact the cast came over to London and rehearsed with us oh, for really? two yeah. weeks with all the writers and how do you go from a casting point of view because they are a very different bunch like I just interviewed uh, Timothy then yeah uh, a great young fella and he yeah. looks great on screen in yeah. this is he, this man didn't act before this. He wasn't in acting in TV. No. So how do you, what gets well, you going? Yeah. Uh, uh, he just made me laugh. Where the, there was a casting director in LA and one in New York who saw lots of people for the role that Tim had. He was the first one that she saw. And we'd actually, in our head, we'd written his part, Jonah, for a sort of small fat guy with a beard. And Tim came in, who's six foot six and thin, and, and he really made me laugh. But we kept saying, but he's not the kind of guy we were looking yeah. for. So we then spent the next month looking at lots of short, fat, yeah. bearded. <laughs> <laughs> and I kept going back to him and just going, but he, he but makes you laugh. It. So it's yeah. a, as good as that. If they can make yeah. you laugh, you'll yeah, cast them. Absolutely. Yeah. Because we, I like to cast early so that the writers get to meet the person ah. and then can write for them. Gotcha. You know. What about yeah. uh, yeah, Julia Louis-Dreyfus, yeah. uh, the star of the show? Was she in your head for a long time? Uh, well, she was. We wrote, yeah. uh, we wrote the part as a woman. We uh, we thought that'd make it a more interesting, yeah. uh, take it away from yeah. it making people think, oh, is this all about Joe Biden or is this about yeah. whatever? Yeah. And of course, as soon as we'd written that, we then thought, well, we need a really good comic actress. So you know, why not go? I mean, the best. <laughs> the best. The be and Julia and I met, uh, never having met before. Yeah. We just met in a hotel in LA. And we, I thought we were going to chat for about 20 minutes. We chatted for about three hours really? about the show. A few drinks? Tea. Oh, tea, oh, that's nice. It was an afternoon. And we just made each other laugh and we came up spontaneously with new ideas for the show. So instantly I knew that's it, you know, that I found my vice president, you know. Well, mate, uh, congratulations again and uh, have a good night. Thank yeah, you very much. Thank you.